Hey everyone, my name is Tim Grant and today is January 25th, 2013 and today is a pretty interesting day because exactly one year ago um, something kind of crazy happened. So um, I was at my friend's house um, and so I was hanging out with him. I don't know where his mom was um, but anyway, so it was me, me, Adam which is my friend that I was at his house, and then Vasily, um, another one of my friends, and we hung out and just played like Call of Duty, and we watched um, a movie about not the Nazis, the rise of the Nazis, and stuff like that. Um, anyway, so then after that, um, we went. My mom picked me up, drove me home, and then once we got home, I went up to bed because it was pretty late. But then while I was um, uh, at in my bed, I usually get on my iPod and just check messages and stuff like that. I, I do that every night. Um, but anyways, um, I saw that Catherine was on. So I go, and Catherine is like one of my best friends, especially at that period last year at this time. Um, she's pretty much one of the only girls that I've ever really liked. Like, I, I know that's crazy because I'm like 17 years old, but I've only liked pretty much her before. Um, I don't know exactly what's wrong with me, but whatever, um, kind of depressing, but yeah. So, um, I really like her, um, and so I started talking to her, and I remember, um, so, well, sorry, um, we started talking and talking and talking, and then I remembered something that my friend told me, um, back, okay, so Catherine is Chinese, and she came and lived with me as an exchange student in my house, um, but then... When she was in America, um, one of my other friends, Travis, he was around and he, so he got to interact with her and he kind of knows her and everything. Anyways, once she left and she was back in China, um, he told me that I should ask her just to see if she did like me, just to, I don't know, just see, because he says that um, he thinks that she did like me. Um, and I was like, I doubt it. Um, so I went when I was on QQ and the conversation was about it and I was like, I finally decided, okay, I'm going to do it. So I like typed up the message, hey, I have a question. Do you like me? Send. Heart beating out of my chest. I get the message. I get a message back. I mean, oh, oh. view. And then it said, um, what does like mean in this situation? And I was like, oh my gosh. Um, so I typed it in, um, what I meant, and then waited for the response, right, waited for the response. And keep in mind, we haven't talked in a while because she has so much homework. Chinese schooling is a lot more difficult than American schooling, so, um, I just had to, or we haven't talked in like a few months and this was the only time that I'd get a talk to her if she was on like break or something like that. So that's why um, I decided to ask her um, today. And so then she finally gets back and after I say, or I ask her, and keep in mind my heart is like beating out of my chest because I'm like, oh my gosh, this is terrifying. Um, and then I get the message. And it says, I still remember this, um, it said, uh, Timmy, we haven't talked in a while, um, I have a boyfriend now. <sighs> oh gosh, like, I, I can't even describe how terrible that was. I didn't, uh, she, uh, like, yeah, so I was so sad, and then the next day when I woke up, I was really sad. Well, I don't think sad is the right word. Depressed would be the right word. I was extremely depressed. So I was not in a good mood whatsoever, and so my parents noticed that, and they were like, uh, what's wrong? Nothing. Um, and I was on my computer right here. And so then they were like, well, what happened at Adam's house? What? Like, because I completely forgot about Adam's house. I didn't even remember anything about Adam's house. I forgot that 
I even went there because it was overshadowed by what happened in my bed. <laughs> in my bed. Um, anyways, so I was, nothing happened there. And, like, in my tone, they were like, oh, yeah, well, what actually happened? And each, because I'm not going to, I'm not going to say, oh, the girl I used to like has a boyfriend. I'm not going to say that. So I just kept saying nothing, nothing. And the, so the more I said nothing, the more they pressed me. So then they were like, so did you do something you weren't supposed to at his house? No, I didn't do anything at his house. Are you sure? Yes, I already told you. And then my dad would come in. Are you sure you didn't get drunk? Or are, did you get drunk? Are you telling me the truth? Yes, I'm telling you the truth. I didn't do any of that. And then my mom would come back and my dad would leave. Did you smoke pot over at his house? No, we didn't do anything. Nothing, okay? Um, and so then that lasted for a while, pretty much the entire day, um, off and on. They would ask me questions like that, and I was in, like, a terrible mood. So each time that they would ask me the question, it would get cemented in their mind more and more that that is the actual truth, that I did go over to Adam's house and um, do whatever. And they were like, are you high right now? No, I'm not high right now. Um... And so I think I never told them. So I think that the final consensus is that I actually did. Sm I bet if you ask them right now, they would think that I did go and smoke pot over at Adam's house when actually all we did was go play Call of Duty, um, eat pizza, and okay, these really cool chocolate lava cakes from I forget Domino. It was Domino's. Chocolate lava cakes, amazing. Anyways, so that's all we did was play computer games, play Call of Duty. T we talked a lot and stuff like that. Nothing, no bad things whatsoever at all. It was just hanging out, having fun. And so, but still, I bet that my parents still to this day think that I got, went and got high at my friend's house. Um, and... Back to the thing with Catherine and how she had a boyfriend. To add insult to injury, me and my mom are really close. We go walking every single Saturday. Um, and so when we were walk, she would always say stuff um, like, you know, I bet if Catherine was in America, she would be your girlfriend. <sighs> what? I, I, I don't even know what to say to that. Like... That, that's like the worst thing you can hear, especially at a time like that. It's terrible. She, and she kept saying stuff like that, like, y you and Catherine would be perfect, blah, blah, blah. And like, I know, mom, okay, I get it. That's never going to happen, okay. And like, so that added a ton of insult to injury to what had already happened and then to make it even more worse um next week and next week last year um was homecoming week that's how i know that it was last year exactly to this day because it's friday um so anyways homecoming week is next week and so i was it's like a, a party pretty much every single day um in preparation for a dance that's right a dance yay so um like, I, I was in no mood to be celebrating a dance at all, and so I was in pretty much a, pr well, I was in a very angry and depressed mood the entire time, and that sucked too, because I didn't get to enjoy my homecoming. So yeah, that is what went down last year, this exact day, and it sucks. Um, I wonder if my parents will ever find out that, actually, no, I have never smoked marijuana. I have never drank alcohol. Actually, I take that back. One time, I got confused with communion, and I got the wine, the little wine thing. That That's the only alcohol I have ever consumed in my life. That's it. Um, I wonder if my parents will ever realize that and know that, but I don't really care because, um, like, I don't know. I think that they've, they've probably forgotten about it, so it's not, like, a big deal, like, a pressing is issue. Like, they've never brought it up, really, after, too much after this time right here. Um, so anyways, yeah, that is just a major thing that happened last year. Last year was a terrible year. I need to do a video talking about how much, 
maybe I've already done a video about how bad last year was, but like, definitely the worst year of my life. It was horrible, like, indescribably terrible. Um, but, and this is just one of the many, many things that went down last year that like, I don't know, it's, yeah. Anyway, so I will see you guys tomorrow, and yeah, see ya.